First official haircut in um, in Africa, and as you can see, I'm fairly scruffy looking. Uh, Simon is here too, my friend from Canada. He's also going to be getting a haircut. So uh, yeah, there's a, a massive shout out to Sammy here in Gadar for for giving us officially our first haircuts in Africa. Thanks, Sammy. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> when everybody is a bad hair day, it's time to go see him. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All packed and ready to go. Um, group kind of so I'm two Canadians and two Americans now and we all kind of came down sick especially one of the Canadians Adrian um, he had a bad dose of food poisoning diarrhea vomiting all that kind of stuff it was pretty grim to be honest so since Khartoum was kind of at a stop start um, time we've had two days of cycling a day off I went back cycling the guys didn't they took another day off and then the following day, I got sick. And I had to be rescued from like the middle of nowhere. Um, so I had, to, I had to get a lift to town, to the next town, because um, I just wasn't feeling good. And I had run into the bushes to um, relieve my stomach issues. I know, pretty grim. But um, it's done now anyways. I got quite lucky. It passed pretty quickly. Uh, the guys had a tougher time, but um, we're all ready to go. Um, we are about 100 miles from the Ethiopian border, so we should cross tomorrow. We're going to take it handy um, because some of the guys haven't cycled in a few days, so um, I think we're going to do half today and the other half tomorrow. And the bike shop has just passed us. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Ah, okay. Salam! Transport Ethiopia, Sydney style. We're on the one road to Ethiopia, the land of beer. Woo i seriously assaulted here by these friendly kids. They're all shouting hello and how are you at us. <laughs> Look at them all over here as well. Where are you going today, Simon? Uh, it's a long day already. <laughs> yeah. The road kind of turned to shite there, so it's been this pothole dividing and trying to avoid the traffic as well. I have like 20 flies in my teeth. Yeah. <laughs> but in like countryside, all this fertile land, a lot of farming going on out here. Makes for a nice change. You know you're going in the right direction. We're actually heading towards Africa now because Egypt and Sudan just seems a continuation of like being in the Middle East. Now we're hitting like the green fields, the mountains, which I can see up ahead, which is a good sign because that means we're getting closer to Ethiopia. Oh, this is heaven on earth. Oh. Oh, oh Finn Simon. <laughs> So we're boiling down to our last few moments in Sudan. I think we have about like 5k to go. And to be honest, that quite makes me a bit sad. It really does. Um, welcome to Ethiopia. We made it here yesterday. Um, we crossed the border from Gadar, I'm sorry, not Gadar, Galabat to a place called Matema. And we found this nice place to stay. This is my room. It's small but it was cheap-ish I think 150 bar which was like five or six dollars I think uh, we had a few beers here and some food and stuff too we got ripped off welcome to Ethiopia uh, what's new apparently from what I've read again look my experiences here may not be as good as other people's because we're on bikes um, just just google cycling in Ethiopia and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about because otherwise I could just mention like a hundred different stories to you guys so um, yeah look it is what it is we'll see how it goes if it gets too dangerous I'm not going to hesitate the bus out of Ethiopia um, so look we'll give it a shot there's five of us together to go we'll see how it is and hopefully we'll be okay but at least at the end of every day there is beer which is great <laughs> of an accident after 2.6k Riley here tried to take out his teammate and friend from America. Um, 
He semi succeeded, but I think he's after damaging a little bit of his own bag, so all's good though. Oh, it's so nice and cool. I didn't even put sun cream on yet. Uh, we've stopped here for some food and uh, the whole village has come out to greet us. <laughs> so uh, yeah, it's good. So far so good in Ethiopia. Uh, Addis Ababa. Uh, Egypt, Sudan. Cairo. Where, where you go? Where you go? <laughs> Where you go? No. <laughs> he says no English. <laughs> Hello. You, 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 you. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Sir? Yes, it's good. Heavy. First taste of Ethiopian cafe. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> so much better than Sudanese and Egyptian coffee in here. Good coffee. Oh, yeah. Yay. <laughs> Simon, how's your coffee? Is it good? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> good coffee. Good coffee. <laughs> they, they think I'm taking a photograph. <laughs> hey. Hey. Uh, getting some um, translation lessons here from from a local uh, English teacher. So, uh, yeah, he's helping us he's translate some words like how are you, food, food, food vegetables, all that kind of stuff. So he's, he's uh, been really, really nice. Hello. Hello. 